Hi, Mr. X with glossary term measure. Noun or verb, measure is very mathematic. As a noun, the measure of something is the size of something. Somebody took a measurement. The size of the measurement is the measure. We talk about the measure of an angle, the measure of a distance, the measure of a volume. As a verb, it means to take that measurement. We're going to go out and we're going to measure something. We're going to lay a yardstick down. We're going to get out a tape measure. We're going to get out calipers and compare them to a standard. We're going to lay a ruler down on a map and compare it to the scale. That's what we do when we measure. Now there's a word here that's rather interesting. Estimate or estimate. That's another word that's either a noun or a verb. Very much like measure. We can estimate a measurement, or we can take a measurement and make an estimate. That's what this word actually is designed to convey. No matter how closely we measure something against the standard, we're making our best estimate according to those standard units. Could you read the measure here? If we assume that between here and here is, say, one inch, Yes, we're going to use English units here because they're divided into sixteenths. Each of these small marks indicates a sixteenth of an inch. This is two sixteenths, three four sixteenths, five six sixteenths, seven eight sixteenths. Well, yes, eight sixteenths is a half. So what would be the measure of this blue bar? What's the measure from here, starting at zero, all the way out to here? I believe that would be 1 and 9 16 inches. Let's say the length of this blue bar is equal to 1 and 9 16 inches. What if we were measuring to the nearest millionth of an inch? Would it still be 1 and 9 16 Of course not. We make the best estimate with standard units. Enjoy hundreds of lessons in the language of math at MrXMath.com.